guys, what's up? My name is Jamie and this is the Home Remedies Database. Welcome. So I'm just gonna give you a small introduction and we'll most likely have an introductory video later uh, for the blog, but I am not the only blogger. Lorena Ruiz is my partner in crime and she's beautiful, she's great. And we are gonna be posting daily about home remedies, the truth behind them, the myths, the bad, the good, stuff like that, whether you should try them out, our personal experience and stuff like that. And today I'm gonna to be telling you about one of them. And just to let you guys know, this is based solely on research, our, our personal experiences, stuff like that. Our research will be at the bottom of every post and the sites will be cited so that you guys can go to the site, look at it and say, oh, okay, so yeah, there we go. That's, that's what they said, stuff like that. I must say, I may apologize for the future that some of the sites may not get onto our post and I apologize for that, but we're only human. <laughs> so let's get on to the video. So acne, I mean tea tree oil for acne. And that is basically the video today. The reason why we pick this is because we were looking through home remedies that we should try out and every single site had tea tree oil as an acne treatment. So guess what Jamie did? Buy some tea tree oil from Walmart. This is, was only $2 in the shampoo section and I tried it out for a week and continued to try it out for a month. And let me tell you guys our background knowledge that we got from our research. So this has been, this oil has been used since the 1800s by sailors due to its antifungal and antibacterial properties. And every single site that we went to said it had antibacterial and antifungal properties. So this has been used for its antibacterial properties since the 1800s. So I bet you someone was probably wondering, why don't we use it for acne? So they started using it and a lot of sites are saying that it's, it's pretty, it works pretty great for acne. However, research states that this is not good. This is, I mean, it doesn't work for people that have cystic or severe acne. It does not work for you guys. And the reason why I believe that is so is because your medication, your cleansers have a lot of stuff in them to help your acne, to help fight your acne. While this is just by itself, it's natural oil. Your face, the acne that you have on your face is different from the acne that people have that have light to mild acne because you have more severe acne and you need more fighting power and certain things in your cleansers to help fight that that bacteria in your face so based on solely on research this is not good for people that have severe or cystic acne because simply it will not really do anything for your acne but for those of you out there that are watching this video that have light to mild acne, this will work great for you guys. The research did say that you some severe acne people could use it, but not all. Because, like I said before, a lot of your medicational cleansers and stuff like that, they have a lot of stuff in it to help with your acne. So like I said, I really honestly wouldn't recommend it to those that have really, really severe acne and cystic acne because it just simply won't do anything to your face. But enough of that, that's just, you know, your warning, you know, you guys that have cystic and severe acne, it may not work for you guys, but those of you with light to mild acne, this may work pretty great. So let me just tell you guys my experience. The first week I saw slow improvement which I expected because we researched it our background research stated that it would work much slower than regular cleansers which I I do not mind but some people may so another disclaimer it does work pretty slowly however it did work in a great way it did help my acne this oil did help my acne over a couple of weeks one two three weeks this is not the type of thing where like your regular cleansers that you use it for two or three days, your acne is gone. No, you need to do this day, night, every day. Or in the morning or at day, I mean at night, every single day. You need to use this every single day so that your the oil can fight the bacteria in your face. And 
it does, like I said, it does work slowly, but I did see improvement over a week, over a few weeks, stuff like that. After a month, my acne was almost gone, really. Like, I had little spots everywhere, and my acne was gone. It, it was pretty, it was pretty cool. Of course, there were some that were still, you know, healing or still there, but still, it was pretty, I was pretty impressed by that. This little oil could actually help my acne. Not only did it help my acne, but it also hydrated my face. So it's not like your typical cleanser. For those of you out there that had the same problem as me, I have super dry skin and a lot of cleansers, for example, Neutrogena are very are harsh on me and they dry out my skin. This will not. It may work slow. The, the, the results you may want may work s slowly or you may get the results you want slowly. However, this is a great, great acne fighting oil that hydrates your skin it's great and based on our research this does help with fighting your acne there are even studies that state that that tea tree oil has antibacterial properties of course some say state that they don't because it doesn't always work for everybody but, however, it did work for me and the research did say it had antibacterial properties and a lot of cases that we looked at did say that a lot of people had improvement in their face, had pretty good improvement in their face. So I definitely recommend that you guys try this out. This home remedy is definitely a truth based on our research. M most likely more than half of the research that we did, probably 60, 70, almost 80% of our research, research stated that this was a home remedy for acne treatment. So based on my research and my personal experience, experience, I totally, I totally recommend this to people that have light to mild acne. And some people with severe acne can try this out, but those of you with really severe acne and cystic acne, it's not going to do anything for your face. You you need those medicated products specifically for your acne. It's specific for your acne. However, light to mild to maybe some severe acne people. You guys can try this out. See how you like it. Comment below. If you tried it, feel free to tell us what you think about it. If you guys have any questions, concerns, critiques, don't be afraid to email us and ask us questions and tell us. We are free, we are open, and we are happy to answer any of your questions and improve our site for you. So see you later. Have a nice day. And Try to look for home remedies. You never know. You might find something interesting. So you see you guys later and have a great day. Bye.